Hey everybody, welcome back to the Maryland campaign. I'm John, and we're gonna get we're gonna actually finish turn four, and hopefully do a whole other turn. That would be really cool if we could get that done. And so, let, you know, I always have to start a video by cleaning up odds and ends. So. All right, let me, let's go ahead and clean up some odds and ends. So we're over here where Jackson is over by Ellicott Mills. And are they within eight hexes of another, of a union unit? Um, where's my cursor? Indeed, they are right underneath Ricketts. They're under uh, the sky right here. So let me get rid of that one, that delete, that uh, not released thing and one two three four five six seven eight they're actually uh eight exactly eight hexes from that guy and one two three four five six seven eight they're actually nine away from the guy by pikesville so we'll hold off on that and 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 that's where we were so when we left this we were actually finishing up turn four was it turn four hold on let me look at it yeah turn four and the basically the rebs were done for the turn and it was just the union was gonna go it was union and knit so with that being the case let's keep doing our thing over here um hold on let's we got some more guys to to release uh the guy in laurel stewart's within eight of him easily two four six so let's get him out of here delete he's released and okay the other ones are uh, those are commitment um you need a commitment role to release those guys so anyway anywho um let's yeah let's get about what we're doing here so let me check over here and see if there's any no none of those guys want to move uh, the second or the 12th core so we're going to activate ninth core all of them again to f2 and they're going due north um or maybe not yeah they are going to head due north all right here's your roll one die plus one it's going to be five here we go one two three four five we'll just take two guys at once let's take all three of them hell one two three four five okay solid uh and uh, well we'll roll the door die and it it's 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 actually union union and net and let's get six core going absolutely six core get rid of the entrenchments delete entrench get them all fatigues the powerful six core um all right one die plus one they're gonna be a seven wow wowzers and they're gonna head they've heard the word and they're gonna head northeast um kicking it over to baltimore goes Franklin with Smith one two three four five six seven one two three four five six and uh, actually he'll just stay right there and then this one one two three four five he'll stay right there all right cool and it die roll uh it belongs to the revs they want to do anything no they'll stay where they are okay so we're gonna set six core do it again go to yellow one die plus one to get to go four let's let's do one at a time please one two three four Stuart, you want to move i have no points left they decline moving one two three four that is to say cab they declined a cab retreat one two three four all right solid and it die roll today 
Um, it belongs to the Rebs. Uh, Stuart, do you want to get out of here? Um, no, I'm not going to get out of here. Um, I uh, Rebs are going to pass. Um, and, okay, so it belongs to the Union. And Franklin's crew are going to go to Orange. They're going to get them out of here. Okay, here's the movement, one die. So they get three movement points. So Franklin says to Stuart, hey, what's the dealio? What are you going to do, my man? And he is going to bounce now because they have three movement points. He put a three on my die here so I don't forget. All right, so that takes him to four. Fatigue. And he's going to disorg. And let's see what the thing says. If there are two in here, uh, cab retreat is uh, uh, what's a two? Okay, if Confederate cavalry in the hex. Oh, this is only for OTR, AGA, and SIV. Only. Okay, I got a plus one. I'm, a, I'm considered a large force in HCR. So, uh, a two, yeah, 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 I'm a plus one. Okay, so here's my roll, plus one. It's a, wow, it's a six, and it's going to be a seven. That's actually going to cost Franklin every all of his movement, but now I got to move four to six. And what am I going to do? Um... One, two, how about now, let's do this. One, two, three, four. We'll go right there. Okay, Franklin just lost all of his movement. Now, Couch can go three. All right, he'll go around. One, two, three. Slocum. One, two, three. All right, solid. Oh, by the way, all, all three of those guys, EM. Smith, EM, he's going to break. Couch, EM, he's going to break. And Slocum. He does not break. Okay, so that's the power of the Rebel Cavalry right there. They just ruined his uh, um, fat three movement. Um, and made two of them break. All right, uh, a nit die roll. Well, wait a minute. A nit die roll, yeah. It's 6-3 belongs to the Union. Now, do we have any other unmoved? Hmm. We could move 6 U.S. and 1st Rhode Island. Let's actually... Which, where do we want to go with those? We want to go left, right? We want to go northeast. We, we do need to, well, wait a minute. There's a first New York right there. Let's activate first New York. Fatigue, increase fatigue, get rid of the uh, entrench, two die, where you want to go to. Okay, so he, he gets to go eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, a knit die roll, two die. Six, five belongs to the Union. More cav. Um, this one's going to activate fatigue, get rid of its entrenchment. Two die, see what they can do. They can go 10. They're gonna head off towards Franklin. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We'll stay right there. And then die roll today. Um, six, six belongs to the Rebs. Rebs, you want to do anything? No, they don't want to do anything. Let's find Munter. I want to see where he is. Where is Munter? Munford. 
Yeah, he's up here. Okay, no, they're going to pass. Pass to the Union. And we're going to move this, our uh, first Rhode Island. Fatigue. Increase. Uh, to die. It's gonna, he's going to go six. He'll go straight up. How about this? One, two, three, four, five, six. A, um, a knit die roll to die. The reps pass at a union for Rhode Island again. Two die. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A knit die roll to die. One, four belongs to the Rebs. Rebs pass to the Union. All right, let's. How about some of these units that just got activated? Let's see what we want to do with them. This guy will stay in Laurel. We know that. And moving right over here. Hmm. What do we want to do? Okay, we, he'll stay there. What about Hooker? Can we bring Hooker south? Um, no, I don't want to touch Hooker right now because Hooker will be fresh if we don't touch him. How about we stretch one of these guys out of here? Johnson. Let's move Johnson out. I'm going to activate him. Fatigue. Increase. One die. He gets to go three. How about this? One, two, three. And the die roll to die. Uh, belongs to the Rebs. They pass to the Union. Activate Johnson. Fatigue. And he just goes one hex right there. Okay. Um, and the die roll to die. 6-4 uh, belongs to the Union. Now we got a lot of Union guys. What do they want to do? Let's look around. Meade, if he doesn't do anything, he's fresh next time. These guys are at bat three with six U.S. Let's move him. Fatigue. One die. Uh, two die. He's a five. Yeah, I see. He'll, act, you know what? I'm going to actually take that fatigue off. I'm going to decrease and just leave him right there. Who else do they want to activate? Um, I, well, I was going to move 6 US and then I didn't realize how far, how close Stuart was. Uh, so we're going to decline that. We may, we, we may just decide to, uh, we may just decide to um, uh, pass all the way around. Oh, no, 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 no. We got one other thing. I thought about this between videos. Um, yeah, the union is going to do this. I can't make things easy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, look at this. Look at this right here. Jones is eight hexes from this guy right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. He is activated. Are there any other guys that he's close to? Okay. No, that guy is activated. Activated. Okay, now, but what we're going to do right here is I thought about this. I gave this some thought. And I am going to move Tremble. Tremble is going to move. Is he going to move into Bolivar? Damn. No, he's going to stay right there. They can have Bolivar, dude. I'm just, I want to move something in the Bolivar, but, um, hmm. The problem is, is Ward supposed to be, or is he supposed to be F3? F3 Ward. 
me look at this. What's the write-up for Ward? And I'll tell you why I'm asking this question in just a moment. Where is Ward? Okay, two, and he has a... They're under Ward and 138 PA are underneath Fort markers. Is that right? I didn't know, realize that. Okay, that's that's good enough. I didn't realize that, but it, that is legit. Um, I think the Union is going to pass as well. I think the Union is going to pass. Both sides are going to pass, and that is... At 16 minutes, that is cool in the gang. And all right, so let's go back to because I let's go back and see what we got going on here. Go back, bring up the um, come on, where is it? Here it is, the advanced sequence of play. Okay, so be now what we're gonna do right here is we're gonna do recovery. Okay. Let's do recovery and see who recovers. Okay, let's look. Has everybody recovered? Now, the Rebs over here look like they recovered. Um, Trimble, Trimble, I don't think that like 8 New York and Trimble... Okay, Ohio did not recover, so let's uh, decrease his fatigue because he's the one I didn't take the thing up. Now, let's. I want to look at something right here, and this here's something that bugs me about this right here. If you read the rules for this, it says it says Union movement restrictions. It says units belonging to Railroad Brigade are our designation, and that includes. That includes Trimble. Okay. Okay, the Railroad Brigade, a unit is removed from this restriction at the moment a Confederate unit moves within eight hexes. Regardless of the Confederate units, the, the aforementioned units may not entrench until turn nine. It doesn't apply to Ford's Brigade or Ward. Okay, so here's here's what I'm saying. Ford is good because that's the way he came in the game, and Ward as well. Trimble should not be able to entrench. So I'm going to take his entrenchment off, delete entrench, and 8 New York is not part of the railroad crew. So he should be able to do that entrenchment that he did right there. Um, Ward began the game as an F3. Ford began the game as an F2. And that's what is the deal with them. But Trimble was entrenching. He shouldn't have been able to. Okay, now I'm going ahead and I'm going to, I'm going to check some more. Uh, let me move out. Check some more uh, recoveries. French. Good. Sykes, good. Green, yep, 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 yep. Good. Good. Couch, Slocum in them, yep, yep. All right, New York, Mead, okay, Mead, and then Hooker should be fresh as well. They are, the both of them. Okay, good. And uh, Jackson's crew, they're where they should be. Um, Lawton, D.H. Hill, indeed. Uh, Munford is where he should be, and Hampton. Okay. Okay. So, all right. So, let's go ahead and do a couple of things here. We need to talk about county control for the first time in this game. Um, Lawton is sitting on the, uh, the county seat for Frederick East, and do they have, so they have to have a certain amount of men to available in, in the, uh, thing. I think they, they do have it. So let's talk about county control. I think they meet the requirements for having that, that county. One moment, let's just, uh, get to the definitive word on this. 
County Control. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's get it. Let's get it. You gotta. It's just you're looking right at it and you don't see it. County Control. There it is. Okay, 11.0. We need to go to to get the word on this. There it is. Control of Maryland counties. Okay, the union player. Um, okay, the compare. Oh, all right, county control. How does? Okay, how to con determine control of county? The county control seat must be occupied by a Confederate unit, which it is, with a manpower of two or more. Must be able to trace continuous thing of supply, which they can. In addition, the 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 county must be occupied by Confederate units with a total manpower of thirteen. Okay, 13. They have 8 plus 7. Okay, so they do get control of Frederick East uh, here, and that is going to be... That's actually 4 points. All right, fair enough. Turn 4. Let's go ahead and make a note for this. All right. Okay, control V. Make this stuff. Uh, this three is a four. Uh, Frederick East County Control. What I do is I just put I just put Fred and a big E and dot and just put four victory points backspace four save. And I go up to the victory point thing. That's going to be... So they now have six victory points. Where'd they get the other two? I don't... I can't even remember. Oh, they... Oh, yeah. They, they, they blew up a depot. All right, cool. So what do we do now? Well, what do we do now? We're, we're moving to turn five. What is turn five is... Oh, turn five is a supply situation and we do get a sub apparently we get a sub for reinforcement so we're now in a turn five all right let me put the sub down here this is easy to forget about let me just throw him on leesburg right there so we're in turn five which is a supply so we get a supply turn we get to read all about supply but i'm pretty well versed on it i just want to catch up supply in this is pretty Difficult, pretty difficult. All right, let's find supply for the uh, the Maryland campaign. Supply, okay. Both players possess depots. Listen, only the Union player may build additional delicate supply. Hmm. Building depots. Why is it talking about depots? Let's talk about supply. Determining Confederate supply status. Here we go. There are two methods of determining supply. Okay, that's during a supply status, a Confederate unit is situated in a county which con currently contains a, a Confederate depot. There's only one g unit that that's that's um, that's uh, uh, affects the presence of enemy units. Okay, if. if Okay, I think basically a lot of my guys are out of supply because I need to be next. I need to be. I need to be next to a depot that isn't occupied by a union unit, or I've got to be in a county which contains a Confederate depot. All right, so I think. Man, this is after playing uh, Rebels in the White House. This is much difficult, uh, much more difficult. So basically, all the Rebs are out of supply. They are out of supply except for this one unit way over here. I don't even know if he's on the board. Yeah, he is. Turn four, and he is live. Delete. That's Funk sitting in went on a Confederate depot in Winchester. He's actually good. Um, turn five. I'm gonna take him off. Delete. And turn five. Martinsburg. Take him off. Delete. Okay. Any other turn fives we got rolling around for the Union? 
they got to come off. Man, I don't think we have any other ones. You know what? Make make the make this bigger so you can see a lot more ground. All right. Okay, good. So I think all the rebels are basically out of supply right now. Um, let's go ahead and make it that way. They're going to be supply, manpower, out of supply. They get the little red check. Manpower. OOS. This takes a little while to get around to all of them. Okay. Unless they're adjacent to a depot. Okay, these three guys. OOS. Out of supply. Jackson's crew. Out of supply. Uh, Stewart. Out of supply. Um, do I have all of them? The Union's pretty much in supply until all their depots are blown up, and I'm working on that. Yep. Okay, so all the Rebs are out of supply, and we move on. Okay, now there's other, something else that's going on in turn five. The Rebels are going to pick up three uh, manpower. Which, when I read right here, at the start of turn five, the commander player adds a total of three manpower points to his army. However, it must be added to the divisions Walker, AP Hill, or DH Hill. Four, you cannot, you got to be four or more. Hexes away from a Union infantry unit. Okay, you got it. You can't. You got to be four or more hexes away from an infantry unit. Okay, so it's it's either either one of the hills or Walker. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to throw it on AP Hill since he is in a bit of a pickle over here with uh yeah we're gonna throw it on a ap hill um oh wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute i am not four or more hexes away from a uh, it says you need to be a four more hexes from a union infantry unit guess what he doesn't qualify. One, two, three, four. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four. The, a division may only be reinforced if it is situated four or more hexes from an... Okay, so he can do it because he is four hexes. One, two, three, four. Four or more. Okay, so he can do it. All right, so his manpower is going to go up three. Increase. Increase, increase. There you go. So now we move forward with this. We racked up the county control. We did the supply and we gave them the special three point bump up on one of the units. And and we hit recover. Everybody recovered that uh, from what I understand. So we go, we're on turn five. Did I move the marker? Indeed, I did September 5th, 1862. And okay, random events. This is always fun. It's a nine. Union command paralysis. No shit. Um, so they get UCP. That means they're not going to free up more units, but they do get to move because the. Um, the rebels are situated in one of those, one of those, they're easily situated in one of those counties, which frees up everybody. Okay. 
but they still you got to remember it's the two or four comes off their movement you got to remember that got to remember that you can't forget about it or you're going to be redoing this whole whole file all right so let's let's do that um Harper's Ferry phase, not yet. Militia, no reinforcements. I did put a rebel reinforcement on. Leader transfer phase. Interesting. Okay, Hooker is not going to leader transfer. Um, could Hooker leader transfer to Ricketts? Let's see how far away he is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now he can't do it. Um. What about Stewart's going to transfer to Hampton? That's for sure. Okay, Franklin is cool. Uh, Franklin is going to transfer to Slocum. Um, Reno is good with where he is. Um, All right, UCP in effect. What about Sumner is going to transfer to French? Um, and William stays where he is. Now, what about the rebel units? What about Jackson and them? Um, Jackson will stay where he is, or, or will he? Or will he? Um, uh, yeah, indeed he will. Okay, moving right along, let's move over to Lee's crew. Lee's crew. Yeah. He'll stay where he is. Okay, all right, we're in business. Okay, so let's go to the first init for turn five. Here we go. 30 minutes in. Let's get it going. Um, first in it. Rebs win first in it. And what they're going to do is they're going to move before the... They're going to move DR Jones. Or... Yeah, they're going to move DR Jones. Fatigue increase he goes right he's gonna go one hexter right there to ball over heights and he needs to do an em now remember oos adds oos adds one to your em so here's the uh here's here's the roll em roll it's a one one add, add one to that he's good okay uh a knit die roll today Six four belongs to the union. Okay, well your uh, your union, your chance to move into Bolivar is over. Okay, um, union, what are you gonna do? Remember, you have UCP here. Uh, what are you gonna do, union? Yeah, I think what we're gonna do is. Um, we're going to move Hooker's Corps to engage Jackson. Okay, we're going to activate Mead. Fatigue. One die. One die. Take away two. He gets four. He only gets to move two hexes. One, two. That's UCP for you, and it die roll. Um, Mead again. One die. Three take away two is one. So that really hurts them. And it die roll two die. Three six belongs to the Rebs. Okay, Rebs, what are you going to do? Now keep in mind, the Union still thinks we're heading to Baltimore. Yeah. What to do? What are we going to do? Hmm. Let's activate. Let's activate Munford. 
fatigue, increase fatigue. Okay, he's going to go two die, plus one. He gets to go nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, a knit die roll, two die. Four, five, belongs to the Rebs again. Okay, they're moving their cavalry in to slow the Union down. Let's minimize this. F. Lee will leave him right there. Stuart. Let's activate Stuart and Hampton. Stuart and Hampton, indeed. Increase. Two die plus three. It's going to be eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the die roll. Union wins this. And... What will they do? Huh. Hmm, excuse me. What will the Union do? I don't think, I think they're going to not move Meade. They're going to get six core rolling at least one time. Fatigue, six core, one die. Well, they get four plus one is five. Take away two is three. So that's one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And a die roll to die. Four, six belongs to the Rebs. Stuart is going to go to yellow. All right. Two die. It's an eight plus three. He's not even looking to do that. He's just looking to s slow me down when he decides to run again. One, two. He stops right there. Um, a knit die roll, two die. Three six belongs to the Rebs. All right, let's go back over to the Lee situation over here. Um, I think McClaws is going to chill this turn. We want to be fresh next turn. Really? Is that right? Yes, it is. Um, Walker. Activate Walker. Increase. Um, one die for Walker. Two plus one is three. One, two, three. Here's a ZM roll plus one. Did I just roll another two? Indeed I did, so I'm good. A knit die roll, two die. It's four, two belongs to the Union. Okay, the Union's sitting pretty over there. They're not worried about a damn thing. All right, let's minimize so we can see what's up. Union wants to keep can, uh, keep moving over here. 12th core. Just going to move once. Going to move one time, 12th core. One die. So it's five plus one is six. Take away two is four. One, no. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's all they're doing. A uh, die roll, two die. Four, two belongs to the Union again. Uh, first, New York. You're going to keep watch on their southern flank. Fatigue, increase, two die. Is, is nine take away four is five. One, two, three, four.
Actually, you just go right there. Okay. Cool. Um, and the die roll to die. Belongs to the Union again. All right, Union. Second core. We'll just go once. So it's a five, take away two is three. Here they go for three. One, two, three. They're going right, they're heading right towards uh, 12th core. One, two, three. One, two, three. If they stop right there, they'll be fresh next turn, which they probably will. Uh, two die. Three, one belongs to the Union again. Sykes. Fatigue, increase, one die for Sykes. It's, well, his minimum is a one. He can always do a one right there. Uh, knit die, roll two die. Two, five belongs to the Rebs. So are the Rebs done over here? Well, they're going to move. Let's move their sub. Fatigue, increase fatigue, one die. Uh, give him a, give him a auto supply, even though he just came on. Okay, one die. Here's their movement. Three plus one is four. One, two, three, four. And a die roll, two die. Uh, again, sub. One die. Six. He gets to go seven. Fair enough. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven to right there. All right, a knit die roll, two die. Uh, five, three belongs to the Union. Union heading up, heading up to the bad guys. All right, okay, Reno's core heading north. Okay, um, due north. One die plus one. So it's a four take. They only get to go two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. And it die roll. Two die. Uh, the, that's the Rebs. Okay, what are the Rebs going to do? Rebs. Okay, I'm going to move F Lee. No, I don't. He could take a he could take a manpower hit. We we don't do. We're not playing that. Okay, let's go back over to Walker. Um, Walker will cross fatigue. He's going to orange. Um, one die plus one. It's going to be three. One, two, three. As you know, you'll never know when it's going to rain. Now, his EM is, here's his EM roll. So he's a five, he flips. Disorg. All right, not a big deal. Everybody's across the Potomac, pretty much, except for Evans, but I don't want him across the Potomac. And it die roll, two die. It's a two, two, belongs to the Reb. So this whole situation over here is good. All right, let's look at all of the, I'm going to move out again, actually, so I can check out all the revs. Now, these guys are holding county control in Frederick Weiss. It's four points per turn. We don't want to move them. Um, Mumford just jumped in front of Hooker as Stewart just jumped in front of Meade, and Jackson and them are not going to move. We want them fresh next turn. I think the Rebs are done. Okay, so this all it's all movement for the Union at this point. So we're going to start moving the Union. The U, Union. And let's get, we're going to finish this turn. The Union. What movement do you want to do? Uh, do you want to take Couch and them to yell? No, because you don't want to lose guys. All right. Now, we'll just chill with those, with six core. Uh, six US, get them going. Fatigue. Increase. Two die. So it's six, take away four is one, two. He 
He's going to go one, two to right there. A knit die roll, two die. A uh, six, six, Rebs. Rebs pass to the Union. Let's see what guys they have back here. None of them are activated. Uh, we're going to move Reno up. We're going to move him to orange or yellow. Um, here we go. And that's going to be one die plus one. It's four, take away two is two. So he's going to be one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. And a die roll, two die. Uh, Belong reps pass to the Union. We'll take Reno to three. Okay, one die plus one. So it's, it's they, they all get to go one. That's, that's all they get. All right, you can move them all straight up one. And they're going to have to do EMs. So the EM for Sturgis, he's good. Cox, he's all right. Rodman, he's four, he's okay. Wilcox, he's all right. So they all pass their EMs. Um, and it die roll, two die. It's four, six, belongs to the Rebs. They pass to the Union. Um... Yeah, first Rhode Island may be the last move. Fatigue, two die. It's an 11, take away four, seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And it die roll, two die. Uh, five, six, it belongs to the Rebs. Rebs pass to the Union. First Rhode Island. He'll go to two, two die, and he gets six takeaway four is two. They'll go to Cracklin Town. All right, and the die roll two die belongs to the Union. Okay, Union, what are we doing? We've been pretty, what's the word for this, this movement? Pretty restrained. We're not pushing ourselves with UCP um, in effect. All right, we've been, we've been pretty chill, actually. Okay, let me widen out one more time. We may be having a situation where both parties are going to pass. Um, a, lot of, a lot of units are resting this turn. Oh, what about Hood? Yeah, what about Hood? We'll act. We'll activate hood fatigue. One die. Did he just roll a six? Wait a minute. So it was UCP. Did they pass? Is that what happened? Did the did the I mean did the Union pass? Looks like they pass. So the Rebs will move, and he rolled a six. One, two, three, four. He'll sit right there. And it die roll, two die. Six, two belongs to the Union. Union, are you telling me that you're done this turn? Um, oh, well, what's this guy going to do? What's 12th Illinois going to do? What is 12th Illinois going to do? Activate him. Okay, 12th Illinois. He's over here doing nothing. Um, two die. It's it's six. Take away four is two. And the die roll two die. Rebs win that. Okay, Rebs. I want to widen out. It's going to be a lot of action next turn. A lot of action next turn. The Rebs are widening out. Um, they are pretty much done for the turn. Um, activate a Union. Okay, Union's going to go back. 
to this um, this cab right here. Take him to two. Two die. Six two is an eight. Take away four. It's going to be a four. One, two, three, four. And a die roll two die. Two three belongs at a Rebs. Rebs pass at a Union. Widen out. I think. I think they may be. Both sides may be done. Huh. I'm saying both sides are passing right now. Indeed. Indeed. Yes. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying both sides are passing. Okay. Um, all right. Cool. So let's do, do we have, well, we, you know what, for the first time in the game, we got a forage. Okay, so let's do some foraging because the rubs are out of supply, remember? So let's do our foraging before we hit recovery. All right, this is a pain in the ass, but it's got to get done. Okay, so let's, let's widen out. We got to widen out to do this. So let's start with. Let's go left, way over here. So these three units that are in Jefferson County, they're in Jefferson County, Virginia, and they are Rebs, Confederate. The number is five, okay? The number is five for Jefferson County. Uh, Walker's ineligible, and so Jones is a two. He needs a one two or a three and that's dr jones one two or a three to pass doesn't pass anderson um he needs a one two three or four because the number is five one two three or four for anderson he doesn't pass that's amazing okay now this now we move into loudon county virginia for evans Loudoun County, Virginia for Evans, which is now a three. He needs a one or a two, Evans. No, does not get it. Okay, that sucks. Um, and now we're in, now what, what are we in? We're in Washington County. No, he's not in Washington. He's in Frederick West. Lee is in Frederick West. It's a four plus. Okay, you add one to your forge die rolls. Okay, so he adds one because can, Harpers Ferry is owned still by the... Uh, so he is a one. Uh, you need a one or a two. Well, actually, you add one to the roll. So it's it's the number is Frederick West is four, and you, you need a three, but you're adding one to your die roll. It's a four. Nope, you don't get it. None of these guys can pass their goddamn foraging. All right, now we move over to Montgomery County, or actually Frederick West for Hood still. Okay, he needs he needs a one, two, or a three, but add one to the roll. Okay, he, he's going to get it. And I didn't flip him over, by the way, OOS, so now I don't have to flip him back. So Hood is where he should be. Sub 1 is in Montgomery County. And Montgomery County is a 4 plus, same deal. Uh, he needs a 1 or 2, add 1 to his roll. Wait a minute. A 1 or 2, but add 1 to his roll. So he's, he's shit out of luck. Okay, so now we move into same deal with these two. Well, these guys are in Frederick East now. Uh, Frederick East is four plus plus. Add two to your rolls. Okay, Lawton, you're adding two to your rolls. He's a six. He's blown out of the water. Uh, and same with Hill. 
He ro now he rolls a one, add two to the roll is three, so Hill gets his supply back. One of the few. Okay, Hill gets his supply back. All right, good for him. All right, moving right along, we're approaching 55 minutes. Munford, Munford is a two, and he is in what damn county, Howard? He's in Howard County, which is a four plus plus. Add two to his roll. Four, he ain't getting it. Okay, now let's do... Let's do Stewart, Howard County, two to his roll. Nope. And now, this is tough for these units over here. J.R. Jones, add two to his roll. It's a four. Nope. And A.P. Hill, add two to his roll. Oh, he does get it. That's huge. Add two to his one is three. And it's a four. So he A.P. Hill, oh, my God. If there's one unit I wanted to get it, it was him. Um, all right, supply, manpower, out of supply. He's actually good. Okay, that's very interesting. Okay, that is it, and now we do, now we hit recovery. Okay, a lot of units didn't move more than they did, so they could be fresh this turn, and that looks to be the case. Let me just go over this real quick. A lot of units got fresh this turn because they didn't really move. Um, and you notice, well, here's another thing you'll notice. Here's another thing you notice is that once I hit this recovery, units that were out of supply, they all went to this org. If you take a look, you'll see that's the, to, that's the case. Over here by Harper's Ferry, all these dudes went to this org. Um, he went to this org. Yeah, if they didn't forge and get their shit back, Hood, Hood is good. The sub, he went to this org. These guys all went to this org. Uh, except Hill. Hill, uh, both of the Hills got their supply back. If you notice, both the Hills got their supply back. Yeah, everybody else is this org, as they should be, as they should be. And, and now let's take a quick look at the unit, the u union, uh, as far as supply goes, and then we'll cut this video short. Okay, uh, Ford, Ford is good. Again, Trimble should not be. Trimble should not be uh, entrenching. And I don't think D.U. Tassie should be as well. Delete and trench. Ford and Ward are able to, and so is that cab unit right there. The other two cannot entrench no matter where the rebels are until turn nine. At least that's the way I read it. Um, good. Just checking Union. Um, a lot of these Union units took it easy, and they, they're coming back, and... They're looking very fresh because they took it easy this past turn. Yeah, why, why bust your ass at UCP? And so now a lot of them are in fresh mode. I see Ricketts went to B1. Yeah, these guys are entrenching. Hooker. Okay, it's good. Now what I got to do is the only thing I got to do is I've got to, again, they have Frederick East, the Rebels. So I need to write another note. Frederick, and it's just going to be a carbon copy of the turn four note. Control C, enter, control V, and I'll make the change that four to a five, backspace five, and it's save. Frederick East, county control, and the Rebs get four more points, which takes them from six to ten. Um, one moment, game markers, uh, pretend, that gives them, okay, then they now have 10 victory points. 
Okay, and we're coming up. This is pretty good because I wrapped up turn five, and what we're looking at is one hour. Again, this is going to be it for the day. I've made two videos. I don't want to do any. So let's take a quick little review right here. The Rebs are trying to set it up for to to um, get control to uh, do surrender rolls for Harper's Ferry. Um, Lee is now McClaws is only a nine because of, you know, of his supply situation. I think they might have to do something else because McClaws is not going to be able to do it. They may have to do something else with another unit. I, in, in retrospect, I wish I would have took two units over here with McClaws. And that's not what was done, so that's that's a problem. Um, anyways, moving right along, and this is what you have over here. The Union is moving out of D.C. They were moving good, but they, they pretty much chilled the last turn. They didn't push it, and now, as a result, a lot of their units are fresh. Okay, they got the 2nd and 12th Corps moving northwest out of D.C. Uh, Reno's guys are moving straight north, and 6th Corps and 1st Corps are heading towards wherever the hell stu uh, Jackson's trying to threaten. All right, and that's the situation, man. It's going to be something is um, brewing right here. Something's going to go down, and A.P. Hill did – he not only did he get in reinforced by three guys, he got his three manpower. He got his supply back, so look for them to whip some asses this next in turn six. All right, I'm John. I'm out. We'll see you guys in turn six. Probably won't see you till, well, maybe tomorrow. Who knows? All right, I'm out. Bye-bye.